Hey Pisces, this is your weekly reading for May. Let's go ahead and jump in. Today we're going to be using the Zodiac 108 by Intuit Oracle. You can purchase these cards on her website. I have the link down below, okay? Um, not affiliated with this company. And I'm not being sponsored. I just want to let you guys know the cards we're using today, okay? Kerosene, what's heating up for you, Pisces? What is going on? First card coming out. So, um, Pisces, we are going to be breaking down this reading. We're going to take a look at the beginning of the week, the middle of the week, and the end of the week here. If you guys like how I'm doing this reading here this week, just leave me a comment down below or give this video a thumbs up so I know uh, that you guys would like to keep doing the weekly readings uh, this way, okay? Um, I, I figure, well, I don't figure. I notice that a lot of my readings here, Pisces, um, they span out more than just for the week here, okay? It may be over the next several weeks. Uh, that's why you hear me say that all the time here. So just know this is, uh, I'm reading it for this week, but it may expand over the next several weeks here, okay? What else is going on for Pisces? Oh my goodness what is going on this eclipse lunar eclipse is um shaking up things for a lot of people we'll get into your cards in a minute let's get your overall energy out here this is for the beginning of the week here pisces middle of the week end of the week <clears throat> for you so Pisces you guys have kerosene that is coming up in your reading here okay aggression uh, fuel to the fire okay night determined volatile situation um, provoked Spirit is saying, watch out for something here. And your cards clarifying it is not too much better, okay? You have the Ten of Swords and you also have the Three of Swords here. Some of you guys may find out that you're, you've are you been backstabbed. You're put in a third-party situation. And I don't say that all the time, but there it is. And that's the energy that I felt when I pulled your cards out here, okay? But they're saying that this won't wreck you. I feel like there's going to be a lot of regret from your person here, okay? Because you're you're still going to be succeeding in your life with that six of wands energy here, okay? Um, that's showing up for you. Let's clarify this. Let's see what else is going on. So, Ten of Swords, Three of Swords, Spirit, why is this here in this kerosene card for Pisces? You have the Four of Wands, the Three of Wands, and the Nine of Wands. Someone's challenging your energy, your power, challenging you. There may be someone out there that wants to step into your life here, Pisces. If you're with someone, I will be careful with someone trying to step into your life, step into your relationship. Um, I'm feeling like someone's trying to shake your very foundation here. It doesn't have to be someone messing around with your lover. This could be a situation that is going on with a friend that tries to um, do something backhanded or stab you in your back in some way. This hurts you here, okay? But I feel like it's not going to break you with the Six of Wands. You really get down to business and start to guard yourself and plan to level up and overcome this uh this situation or this person here okay you can't be shaked and you will not be blocked here pisces that's what i'm seeing with the nine of wands they're telling me that there's a lot of grit um and you're determined you're putting up boundaries you're stopping people in their tracks you're saying no you are disconnecting from individuals that you have been hurt by as well you're not going for it that's what i feel three of swords ten of swords here okay this is the end of, of stabbing pisces in the back here i will succeed okay you are a survivor 
I don't know how else I can put this here, but I feel like your uh, energy will be challenged. You will be challenged here this week, Pisces, okay? But um, I feel like you're coming out on top here. By midweek, you're going to find out who this is. You have air sign that is coming in here, person of air, and you also have the eclipse that is showing up. So something that is hidden here, something that uh, I feel like there is something hidden that's about to be revealed. Okay. Sudden darkness that is revealed to you here. You have the five of swords, the seven of swords. You need to check out Libra's reading. <laughs> I don't know why everybody's going back to Libra. I said the same thing for Gemini and Aquarius kind of felt like that as well. You need to check out Libra's reading or you need to check out that reading if you have Libra in your chart. But they they came out with the same type of cards. Okay, Aquarius and Libra. The Seven of Swords, the Five of Swords here. So it, what's being done behind your back, whoever's challenging you, whoever is against you or working against you here, uh, Pisces, this person, this situation is going to be illuminated. Whatever has been camouflaged, okay, by this person of air. Um, because some of you guys are dealing with uh, an air sign here, okay? Something is coming out where you have air in your chart. Let me just say it that way, okay? Whatever is being hidden, whoever is wearing the mask, they're coming out. They're, they're about to be revealed here, okay? You have the Ace of Wands. I feel like this is going to actually free you, believe it or not, okay? You have Libra and Aquarius on this card. You also have Taurus on these cards here as well. So you guys maybe deal with the Taurus. Um... The Ace of Wands is um, is letting me know here that whew, they've lost out on a good thing here, Pisces. It's you. Three of Coins, Ace of Cups here, and also the Page um, Page of Cups, Messenger of Cups in the reverse position. Man, they messed, they messed up. Whoever this is, they're going to regret it. I said this in Aquarius reading as well. Like, whoever messed you over did you bad. I probably said in Gemini's reading too. Um, they're going to regret it here. Someone is not loving you the way that you should be loved. Here, someone is a pure manipulator here, okay? I'm not going to say narcissist, but they're a manipulator. Or they're trying to manipulate a situation, but... They're not going to get away with it. I feel definitely spirit is going to show you who this person is, okay? Um, mm, who this person is. It may be someone that you're working with or working for. Someone that you're collaborating with here. Three of coins. Like I said, this doesn't have to be about a lover here. But I definitely feel like it, it is someone that you know. Someone that you're in contact with. Someone that you have spoken with here. That has something against you. Like I, I feel like there may be a touch of jealousy. Uh, and they're trying to change your world. Or change your relationship with your person. Or get into your world. And try to... <clears throat> excuse me um mess it up in some type of way here why is this ace of cups here for a lot of you this is a romantic situation <laughs> you have the ace of wands that's showing up i'm going to switch gears here because you have aces that's coming out ace of wands showing up twice in the ace of cups that's showing up for you as well this may be new love for you it may be new love for your person that is interfering in both of your lives here if you're with someone here okay if you're not i definitely feel like if this is a new opportunity for love that's showing up and you may have people in your life that want to <clears throat> mess up your relationship or they're jealous of this relationship this connection that you're going to be entering into a new romance for a lot of you guys but also the ace of wands and the ace of cups is letting me know that this is a romantic success here that others will wish that they had <laughs> they wish they uh, they had what you had here okay four of cups in the reverse position here okay so either you're loving on yourself more or you're going to be stepping into a new relationship here or you're going to find out that someone has stepped out on you. I feel this energy here is all coming in for you. Okay, by the end of the week, you guys have roundabout and sap 
that is showing up for you here, Pisces. So Spirit is saying, <laughs> keep it moving with this roundabout here, okay? Keep it moving, but not in circles. Some of you guys have dealt with this situation before, okay? Gemini, um, Pisces energy that's coming in here. Pisces and um, Scorpio energy. Virgo energy that's showing up. You have the Page of Wands, the Will of Fortune, and the Hangman. All right. They're wanting you to move forward and keep moving forward here. There is, by the end of the week here, and this could go or last for several weeks here, okay? Some of you guys may feel like things are falling apart for you or this news is very disturbing, something that you find out, something that comes to light, something that has been hidden from you. You feel like it is tragic here. Uh, I feel this energy here, okay? But I definitely feel also on the other hand that this is actually releasing you and freeing you to step into a new world to step on a new path here and i feel like spirit is removing these challenges and these obstacles out of your life it could be a situation or a person but they're being moved off of your path because they're creating a lot of delays towards your own personal growth and development and happiness here pisces this person is being removed almost like the tower card here okay um they're also revealing things to you as well with this uh, hangman that's coming in for you to reevaluate where you want to go and what you want to do. And that I feel like they're pointing you to, in a new direction. That's why you have this round a roundabout card coming in. Yeah. And let me tell you, this high priestess is popping out everywhere everywhere for everyone here okay they're wanting you to listen to your intuition you have the four of coins just like the four of cups midweek coming in the reverse position here okay so stop holding on to things release materialism release a relationship that you feel may be very challenging release a, a situation that is holding you back here and you will experience success and abundance and uh plenty okay Things will flow mo more easily. You may even get the lover that you have been looking for. Okay. The lover that you have been wanting here, Pisces. The, you may get that love here. Okay. That you have been wanting um, in your life that you need. And I definitely feel like uh, the sap card is letting you know that it's time to plant your roots somewhere else here. Okay. Focus on your uh, nourishing yourself, nourishing your life. Uh, they're saying flow, wealth, and abundance, and needed material and resources is coming in towards you here, okay? Will of fortune. That's showing up. Wow. Okay. So there's going to be challenges not only for you, but there's going to be challenges if you're in a relationship for your person as well. And you're going to see exactly how this plays out with them and how they respond to this disruption in your connection here. Will they take the bait from whoever this is coming in to you? Uh, disrupt your relationship here okay my other Pisces I see that the relationship was possibly already disruptive with the five of swords and the seven of swords your person has possibly um, been this way here and not they weren't loving you the way that they needed to be the way you needed to be loved here okay I feel like they may have been very critical uh, of you or have always been very critical, possibly even controlling here with the person of air. Um, but they know what they were doing. That's what I feel here. You're going to find out something. But you had the six of wands at the beginning of your reading. And at the end, you're still winning here, Pisces. You're going to overcome whatever this is. Will it hurt? Yeah, it will hurt your heart to find out the truth about someone. But spirit is definitely letting me know that this is not going to break you. Whatever this is, it's not going to break you. It's actually freeing you and they are removing people, places, and things off of your path uh, because they're tired of seeing you stuck and blocked in the same place here. So they're removing this energy, okay? This low vibration, these secrets, these lies that I'm seeing here off of your path here in order for you to step on into a new journey here in your life.
Pisces. That is your reading. Very interesting and straight to the point here. If you guys got a message from this reading, let me know down in the comments section. All right. Like I said, this reading may expand several weeks. This may not happen all in one week for you guys. Because uh, by midweek, I still see that there is things being hidden by the end of the week things come to light for you um somewhat here but spirit is saying still i'm giving you signs use your intuition okay so you're you're gonna have to think on your own and think for yourself here all right and start to really unclutter your life and think about your priorities here with the four of coins in the reverse position you releasing people places and things that don't resonate with you anymore um and i definitely feel like over time more information will come out important conversations important communication will come out with page of wands here okay even though <laughs> Page of Wands is like good news coming in towards you here, Pisces. It's actually good news coming in. Um, it still may be hurtful to the heart to find out secrets. But I feel like you knowing what's really going on in your relationships and in your life and, and with the people that you're dealing with puts you back in a place of power here, okay? It really helps you stand in your power and think about... Um, being successful in your life, okay? Having vision and moving successfully forward in your life with no regrets, okay? It leaves nothing to the imagination when you have all the facts here. And I feel like slowly but surely, uh, facts are going to be shown to you, okay? That is your reading. I will talk to you guys later. Take care. Bye.